Hola Columbus is a bilingual entertainment show and magazine in Columbus combining the Hispanic and English speaking communities and they cover businesses and events all over central Ohio and this weekend you can find them at Stonewall Columbus Pride 2014. Joining me now with all the details is Jennifer Wilson and Keisha Mathis from Hola Columbus <laughs> along with Kyla Rothen she's the executive director of Stonewall Columbus and it's a pleasure to have all you here. Thank Hi you. Gail. Well right, this is a big day big weekend. Yes. It all starts today. Yes 350,000 of, of my person, personal and close <laughs> friends will be here today, you know, and so it's going to be fun. At 4 o'clock we start uh, tonight and we will have entertainment all night long until 11. And then tomorrow is the parade, Saturday, 11 a.m. on the corner of Front and Broad Street. And we will travel north on high to Goodale Park and we'll be open until 8 o'clock on Saturday. So it should be really exciting. And this is one of the biggest Pride weekends in the country, am I right? Yes, we are second only to Chicago in the Midwest. And we're one of the few prides that keeps on growing all over the country. You know, some prides have kind of leveled off and maybe they keep uh, the same amount of people every year. But every year, for some reason, we just keep getting bigger and bigger and bigger. Well, I know Stonewall Union is the big sponsor of this. And I'm, there might be some people that don't know what you do. So can you explain? Sure. You know, Stonewall Columbus started in 1981. There were three guys who decided that they were upset with the discrimination that was happening in our city. So they staged a march down High Street. And we have some, I believe, Channel 4 coverage of that from 1981 <laughs> on there. Uh, yeah, we had just moved. And yeah. you had your fair hair <laughs> <laughs> and your big shoulder pads. Oh my gosh, now you're calling me out. <laughs> no, 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 so look back. So look back. We have to see that. We yes. have to see that. We're going to look it up more. But that was 1981. Yes. yes, and you know, people were marching with bags on their heads. They were marching in disguise. But fast forward to 2014. And it's not like that anymore. We're going to have a lot of allies, a lot of allied churches, businesses, politicians, and friends. So. And this is some of the video. And okay, we just saw a picture of George there. Yes. What's the deal with George? Well, George Takei, of course, an Asian American actor and activist, does a lot of humanitarian work. He is actually coming here um, at his own expense to celebrate with us and be our Grand Marshal of Pride. So we're very excited. You know, our theme this year is Created Equal. We wanted to draw, draw attention to all of the issues and atrocities that are happening with gay folks all over the world, not just here in Columbus, Ohio, or in the United States. And George has done a lot of traveling, just got back from from uh, Japan, actually, and overseas, he's been w doing a lot of work on humanitarian efforts. Well, that has to be wonderful for you all to know that you have a big name who's really going to, you know, behind what you do and be your big grand marshal. You know, it has its challenges as well as its perks, <laughs> but we are very excited. Security, that, yes, security. Really security. <laughs> that and just uh, a lot of people coming out that probably have never been to the Pride celebration before, but just love George. So, oh. <laughs> so we should be uh, ready for that as well. Well, you can yeah. introduce them to that which is a good thing you want everyone in the city to be introduced to who you are and what you do and this is a great way to do that yes you know visibility is the key the more likely that you uh, meet someone and you find out that they're gay or lesbian the less likely you are to discriminate against them so being out being visible letting people know you're here and that you're contributing to Columbus Ohio in a very significant way not just during pride season but all year long is a really important thing to do and this year yes. Jennifer you are all at Columbus is in the parade oh, aren't you of course yes we are <laughs> Excited, aren't we? We're so yes. excited. Tomorrow, like um, Carla was saying, we start at 11 a.m. and we're gonna be uh, near the front of the parade. So we're so excited. We're gonna gi be giving out like free frisbees and balloons and t-shirts. So look out for all the Columbus. Yeah, there's <laughs> a lot of entertainment with this, and you ladies get to interview some of that top entertainment. So Keisha, yes. who are you gonna interview? Um, we get to interview Vicky Martinez, Crystal Bauer socks, um, and you know Vicky Martinez w is actually performing at the Pride on Saturday. Um, her new hit single, Otro Cancion, which means yes. another song. Um, so yeah. we get to have some pretty VIP interviews going on that day that we're really excited about later in the evening. And then <laughs> another one, Beverly McClellan. Yes. Who gets to interview her? That will be me. Um, <laughs> yes, um, she was actually on The Voice, um, and I'm really excited to kind of hear what her experience was like working with Christina Aguilera. You know, that's a very big name, so um, really excited to kind of see what's going on and how their experience was with the whole um, The Voice, American Idol. So a lot of footage we're going to have to cover. Yes. And then Crystal Bauer Sachs, Toledo native, so an Ohioan. She's exactly. also going to come, and you both are going to interview her, right? Yes. Today it's going to be Crystal Bauer Sachs, and we're also going to be interviewing Liberty Deep Down which is another band here from Columbus, native from Columbus. So we're so excited. Uh, there's a lot of music, entertainment, and a lot of fun coming up. And right now we're seeing Crystal Bauer sucks um, going and playing. Uh, she was an American Idol. I don't know if you've seen it, but like, she's been doing great after her appearance in American Idol. So we're so excited.
excited to find well, out yes. everything. It's going to be a fun weekend. Carla, it's a pleasure to have you here. Everybody enjoy. <laughs> Thank, Thank you, you so much, Gail. We'll see you this weekend, right? Maybe. We have to, yeah. <laughs> <laughs>